this war that we just had has forever changed the series. And to see that, you know, this is like the last chapter of the actual arc and stuff like that. I thought like kind of like la last week's one was it. And this one just kind of left a very big impact. And just like, I'm not going to lie, when I read this chapter last night, I'm going to say I was tearing up. I was starting to get there right at the end. The fucking feel it feels like a shogun. The fucking shogun, man. They actually decided to kill a character that I thought was always just going to be there for jokes and stuff. But no, he's been there and did some fucking beast epic shit and all that so pretty much this was the aftermath and all that and in a way the bad guys actually won they finally got their position you know nobody's like up there as the shogun and stuff like that and takasuki like yo this man has been knocked out for two weeks straight and even one thing that can we said like yeah this guy he's been through hell and all that but he hasn't given up i saw that look in his eye when he was like down for the count and all that that's that's fire burning in his eyes right so it's kind of even crazy still like the war has not even like yeah the battle was won but the war kind of was lost though it was like and this just show, goes to show that we might have another one of these epic fights to come and all that in Gintama. I'm like, either we're going to have another epic fight or Takasugi and Gintoki are going to team up on the next time. Because that shit was beyond fucking godlike and all that. Let's just get that one thing straight. That, like, this entire war and all that, which was about, I don't know, like 13, maybe 14 chapters. We had it probably about three months worth of this arc and all that. Which is, you know, for a serious Gintama arc, which I've noticed as well, what Sorachi uh, does now is like, that's normally how long an epic arc of Gintama is it about like months worth of material and it's normally adapted into a war, about four or five episodes or something like that I gotta say that is the most sickest shit I gotta say that and just to see it even as well as like you know the Shogun was leaving and all that and it was like seeing everyone at first I was like oh my god Sarutobi's in a fucking wheelchair like everyone's gone legit fucking hurt right now like in Tokyo's in the hospital all fucked up same thing with like everyone else and all that and it was like oh no never mind she's just a fucking joke she just came back out and it was like okay yeah this arc and all that, I like how it kind of left on a little bit of comedy there, but it was like those last few panels and all that, which is so sad. When we saw the Shogun there, he was like, I'm going to go see my old comrades, and one of them stabbed him in the back, saying, you know, you no longer have any allies in the world, and it hits him with like a little poison dart, and he's there, just sitting down with his sister, and he's like, yo, I can finally relax now. And he just dies in her arm. Fuck! That is some fucking powerful shit there. And so, like, reading the letter and all that, saying, like, we'll always be comrades the next time you call me by my real name. Shige, shige. And I was like, ah, fuck. Like, that's the feels I want to see there. But as the question is now, especially with this whole, like, let me just get one thing right. This, like, this chapter was amazing as well. Pure feels, pure, like, emotion. And it's actually generally left a huge impact in the world now. Like, this arc is literally going to always leave a mark on the series now from now on and it really begs the question now where are we going after this are we going to have another chapter of a little bit of an aftermath or something like that what's going to happen i'm genuinely curious right now I can imagine we might go back into a little bit of comedy and all that for a while and you know maybe i might talk about one or two of them here or there but i don't expect myself to be you know talking about the comedy of Gintama every week and all that but it's just mad to see that, you know, this is Jeremy. Honestly, I loved it. Chapter, probably an 8 out of 10. I generally loved it. But let me know in the comments section down below what you thought about this. But it's all for me. So thank you very much for watching as always. And I'll see you guys next time.